Hello gamers, geeks and gays, my name is Sturx, and welcome, welcome to Still Wakes the Deep. This is essentially the spiritual descendant to Soma, in my eyes anyway. This is one of those games that follows the amnesia pattern, and that's partly because probably the devs are responsible for amnesia machine for pigs, but takes it to a maritime location. Very similar to Soma in that regard. We are an oil rig worker from Scotland who is stuck on this rig with something eldritch, something otherworldly, something horrible and unknowable. And that sounds awful. Those who don't know, I have a deep seated thalassophobia kind of complex. I'm terrified of the deep sea, but I'm absolutely enthralled by it. I want to be a sailor, I want to see the world. But something about this is going to haunt me, and I know it is. This game is a love project, it's a passion project, and I can't wait to see all the detail that's gone into this. It's set in the 1970s, and it's meant to be an incredibly authentic look at that time period and the oil rig kind of culture that came about. The North Sea oil fields in UK history are very, very important to us and it's been a very heated centre of topic and conversation for quite a long time. But to the Scots, this was quite an integral part of, you know, their livelihood for definitely during the 70s. And that's what this is all about. It's got a lot of Scottish culture. The soundtrack is incredible. I need to watch some more of the dev videos, but I didn't want to spoil anything for me. I have been waiting for this game for so long. I've just loaded in the game just beforehand just to make sure everything runs okay. So what we're going to do now, we're going to start a new game and we're going to go at it. And I don't know how long the game is, but we're going to we're going to play the whole thing. I'm looking forward to this. We have two different game modes. We've got standard and story. Standard is the recommended balance of challenge and story. Use caution or speed to survive. Well, luckily, I'm fast as heck, boy. And we've got story. Experience the story of Still Wakes the Deep with a reduced fear of death. I like that it's a reduced fear of death. It's you can still die. Things are still going to be scary, but it's lessened. I like how they don't just hold your hand. Um, I remember actually seeing one of the dev videos a while back about that and I was very happy that they were just going to hold your hand through the experience. I wish someone would hold my hand through this experience. I still can't believe you went. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. You can't run forever. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us. Now, please, Kaz. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. I want you home. The girls want you home, but... If you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. I love you. Wait forever. Jesus. 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 The girls need you a Christmas card. Fuck. Oh. Ah, fuck. Merry fucking Christmas. Kaz, Roy's finishing up breakfast if you want something. I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Trots. Right, well, don't wait too long or someone will be up with you. Aye. All right. <laughs> I love this. If I didn't have the subtitles on, I know people would struggle to understand some of the things that are being said. Um, but oh my god, I. Wow. Wow. That's okay. That's that's really quite. That's really quite nice. I like that. I don't even have this on the highest preset because my PC would just implode if I did so. But oh my. Look at the rug! 
There we go. Half an hour of Sturks just gawking over pretty things in the game. Can I have my can I have my hot coffee? I want my coffee. Uh, sorry, Geralt. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I almost kind of expect this to be drawn by one of the devs' kids. I would not be surprised at all. That was awesome. Look at so we've got boxing. Your mother wouldn't like it, the MG. Of course, we've got a very, very uh, conservative pin-up girl kind of uh, calendar. Oh, we've even got family photos! This place is hideous but beautiful. I like all the, the jumpers, like the knitted wear. Okay, so we've we've read that. What what is it? Nineteen seventy five, eighteenth December, nineteen seventy five. So it's about to be Christmas. Christmas on an oil rig. Fantastic. Oh, can you use the radio? Anything on the radio? No, the radio does not seem happy at all. Oh boy. Right, we we were going for food. I'm here. Uh, food does not appear to be on this deck. We've got showers. Was that someone laughing? There was someone laughing. That's someone in that room. That's cool. Uh, the, the beer is center. Gas to fuel. Re I don't know what any of this is. Right, so I'm here. What is... That's locks, is what that is. We're not going that way. Got night shift. Oh! That's actually really cool. McCleary, it doesn't say what shift we're on. I'm guessing that means we're not on the night shift then. Oh my god. So it's very, very pretty. I don't really want to go into random people's rooms. Hello! Who are you? Hey, Cavs! I'm alright. What are you doing up there? Pipes leaking. If it's not one thing, it's the other. See this whole rig? It's a pile of shite. It's falling apart. And we've only just started drilling. Fucking Kadal. And fucking Rennick cutting corners. Aye. Speaking of, you are in the shite, wee man. Rennick got a letter this morning from the mainland and he's been up to a high dough ever since. Heard he's gunning for you. That's just brilliant. Christ, I need a smoke. Can I find my lighter anywhere? Take mine. I don't need it anymore. Honestly. You're a fucking lifesaver. I'm going to get breakfast. Alright. I'll see you for darts tonight. We'll put a wee picture of Renick up on the board for you. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. See ya. So I'm guessing Renick is our boss. Right? Anyone in the showers? Dad is a man in the showers. We're not going to go in there. <laughs> hmm. Hello. Goodbye. I'll let him shower in peace, I guess. I love the voice acting, by the way. I can show my main objective. Ah, cool. I am loving the voice acting. It, it feels believable. I, I think sometimes in games, obviously there is a level of accepting that you're in a video game. But there is definitely a good level of immersion going on here. I'm liking this. Right. Chat with Trotz, O'Connor, and Gibbo. Gibbo. Look, there's no escaping. There's going to be a dozen mere rigs up here by the end of next year because the pricks in Westminster want their grubby wee hands on Scotland's oh, oil. Christ, none this again. The bear is already down to the bare bones, and Cadal are just going to make more cuts to get other rigs on the go. If we don't take industrial action soon, oh, this place. Oh, come on. If we don't take industrial action soon, this place will be even more of a death trap than it already is. He's got a point though, Gibble. We're down to a skeleton crew in the pontoons and it's ropey as fuck down there. Workers of the world unite! What do you think, Kaz? <sighs> I don't know. Just see <laughs> if it fix the lecky. <laughs> what do you think will be keeping the lights on if this place falls apart? That's coal, you numpty. <laughs> 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 There's always one. Also, my eye is running. I'm still suffering with hay fever and I wish it would just go away. 
there's always one guy in any place like this uh, who's very big on like the industrial action and the unions and stuff. I've worked in places similar to this, not on an, an oil rig, but I have worked in like industry. Oh, hey, Roy. Cars, mill, mucker. I do. McClary, to my office. That means no, not as soon as you're ready. No. Ah, the sweet sound of Davy Rennick. You think it's the polis? Can't be surprised, Kaz. Have you heard from Suze? She's talking about divorce. Oh, I'm sorry, Kaz. She'll come around. Not if I get to jail, she won't. Well, maybe you could have considered that while you were battering Billy Chamberlain's head in. Cunt slagged off Suze. He had it coming. And there he is. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, and swears like the devil himself. Listen, mate. Even if it is the polis, maybe it's best to just go back and face it. Yeah? I don't know, Roy. I'm fucking scun up with the whole thing. The Lord loves you, mate, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure Suze does too. That's all clear for you now, Roy. Lovely job, thanks, Dobby. Oh, Dobby? Says he's left your insulin in your cabin. Oh, bless his little communist socks. Muchly appreciated. Ta. Remember, life is like football. It's not over until the final whistle. Aye. You're a Barnsley fan, so you're pretty much <laughs> fucking me off, right? Oh, I will see you hand for that, McCleary. Off you trot, lad, before his nibs blows a gasket. Oh, I love, I love that. As as someone from the UK, there's a lot of references here that I'm actually getting, and I love it. Right, where, where am I going? That way. Follow the signs to the deck exit. Okay, so we're actually an electrician, which is quite cool. Oh, we're going to the next area. That's what we're doing. It even told me what we were doing. I'm loving this so far. I'm massively loving this. Head outside onto the deck. Oh, oh my god, I'm even putting me... I'm putting my PPE on. I'm taking my job seriously. I like that. See, they could have just let me go outside and I probably wouldn't have even... like, batted an eyelid. Head up and see what the score is. Wow. Oh my god, this place is bigger than I was expecting. This is huge. Well, all right to get by, pal. Sorry, you have to go around, cards. Uh, where, where is around? Across the deck. It's Renick's office, so I need to get down there. There's a ladder. There's a ladder. There's a ladder. I can climb ladders. I can do that. So, Kadal, I'm guessing, is the company. I'm liking all the different dialects. I can't place them all. I'm, I'm not an, you know, I'm not an expert. But there are a lot of different dialects of like the UK here, like there's, there's an Irishman, Roy's obviously from England, um, loads of different Scottish accents and I'm, I, I just, oh, I'm already hooked. Can I get out here? So I'm here, installation manager is up there. So, like, up there is where I'm thinking Rennick is. Need a hand there, fellas. McCleary. No, I can scale finish you all by myself. <laughs> no, we're all right. Cheers, though. Fair enough. You want to transfer here, McCleary? You give me less lip. No. Who loves it? McCleary, my office. But don't make me ask again. In a better mood today, is he? We'll be all right. <laughs> we'll get used to it. We all get hurt. Try not to punch him. Ah, <laughs> no promises. Okay, so this Reddit guy seems like a bit of a piece of work. So we're just gonna, we're gonna be good. And I'm gonna stay in the green. I'm gonna stay in the green. This is health and safety, right? Gotta stay in the green, and then you're okay. Within reason. Drilling personnel only, maintenance, all this. All right, Roper, what's the problem? Don't usually see you down here. Ah, trolls acting up this morning. 
Got the crew running around like blue ass flies, but they kinda make head or tail of it. Is that you's behind schedule then? Oh, not yet. And not if the gods are smiling on us. So mere fuck than ever. Oh, as fucked as you by the sounds of it. Look, you better get up there. The boss man sounds raging. Why is the drill struggling? And will that have anything to do with a certain eldritch thing? I guess we'll find out. Right, let's try and get our way through the rest of this. This is awesome. And there's so much just noise. Am I going up a lift? No, surely not. No, I'm not going up the lift. I like how it's even telling me to do the help and safety thing. Scooby, give me a heart attack. Oh, sorry, mate. Can I ask a wee favour? What do you need, Scoob? Oh, could you do me a quick fix on the crew lift fuse box while you're down there? Aye, nae bother. Oh, you're a lifesaver, mate. And don't let the big man get you down, all right? Thanks, pal. What am I doing? Am I doing electric? I'm doing... I'm doing a lecky stuff. Where's my lecky stuff? Where am I doing? Where am I going? Am I going in here? Ah! The fuse box on the lift. Oh, yeah. I have used fuses like this. Colour me impressed. Okay, so installation manager is on five. I think. Am I reading that right? Yeah, that's five. Or is this going to take me straight up there? I think it's going to take me straight up there. Why have you not in my office? This guy. Okay, so we're not going that one. Going in this one. <laughs> Installation manager. Ah, here we go. Right at the top, so we can see everything. Let's see how this goes. He sounds ah, happy. Mr. McQuarrie. So glad you could join me and sorry to have got you out of bed. Shut the door and have a seat. Oh, I'm fine, Stan. Sit your ass in that chair, you fucking liability. But I don't... I run a tight ship. Do you understand me? A tight ship. Technically, it's not a ship. Shut your gub, you Ned prick. I am sick. Sick to fucking book on a you wee gub shakes messing with my operation. That chef might be a mate of yours, but he does not run things around here. I do. Do you understand me? All right, why don't you just get on with it? Don't you answer me back! You might be the height of shite on shore, McQuarrie, but out here, I am the fucking king. He's going to die first, right? You bring the polis to my door, to my rig. Uh, I, I can sort this, right? I just need time. Shut it, you. Clatty gobshite. I've got here's a man who can make a more positive contribution to this operation than you. Look, I know Shut it! I'm in a meeting. What? Look, sake, Gibble, I don't care. We're on a schedule. It's a fucking drill. You've got a fucking drill, so drill through it. Yeah, well, Roper's a whiny old fud. He's got a problem with everything. I don't care if it feels half. Just fucking do it! Or I'll come down here myself! That, uh, trouble with the missus? You're fired. You hear me? Fired. Uh, come on, man. It's only a wee bit of trouble with the polis. I'm good with the lecky. I keep things running. You said it yourself. Out! Get off my rig! Aye. A happy new year to you too, you cunt. Well, he seems to know exactly what he's doing and isn't pressuring people into doing a bad job of things. Do I not even go to get to go with my stuff? I need my stuff! What about my stuff, dude? That sounds wrong. That sounded so wrong. 
Coming for you guys. And what have we done wrong? What have we done with the police? What do we do? Are we a bad person? Why do we always end up being a bad person in these games? Pretty fire. Oh, that's not good. But you're a right pair. Two bars and a ball bag. Now listen, Pat. I promise I'll take care of him. I had a word with our Kieran. You remember him? You know, it's Billy Chamberlain from way back. Owes me a favor. Reckons he can sweeten Billy up a bit. Come on. Have I ever let you down? Roy, you lost the cake at the wedding. No, now then, now then. That, that wasn't my fault. You left it on a bench at Argyle Street. Aye, you were that bloated you didn't even remember baking the cunt. Oh, my children, that was before the light of the Lord came to me. Here we fucking go. Uh, and you, Mr. McCleary, you can fuss and cuss all you like. But perhaps if you went to the Saracens a little less and the Tabernacle a little more, then perhaps you'd not be in this pickle, eh? Don't, don't look at me. You're the one who decided to spend the next four months trapped on our egg with this bum pot. Susan, I promise you, I promise you, we will get this straightened out. I will. You'd better. So we know Roy from before working on the rig. Guys! Christ! He's got gold! Shit! Guys! Get his leg! We can't leave him out here! Move! Fuck! Kev! I think he's deep! We got you, man, alright? We got you! He's breathing, thank Christ! Kaz? Wake up, Kaz! Why, you're not waking up, can you hear me? Is he gonna die, Brody? <laughs> Kaz? <laughs> Where's first aider? Do we have a first aider? Or was the first aider the one who went over? I feel really tense all of a sudden. And I don't really know why what am i hearing Guys, I need your help here. what the heck Do I want to? It's all right. We're getting you out. We'll be two minutes. What? Now. What? What? That's really right. Disengage winch brink at a lower level. Okay. Where's the? Okay. This. This. All right. Press and hold. Pull. There we go. I don't think this is a good idea. I've seen enough horror movies to know where this is going. Let's 
going on, Brody? What happened? Don't know. The drill hit something. An air pocket or gas explosion, nobody knows. But whatever it was, it was big. You were lucky, trust me. Douglas is trying to find out Mayor. Like if the bear is even safe now. What's wrong with Raps? I don't know, all right? Decompression shouldn't be this bad. Oh, I shouldn't have let him go down there. I said I'd look after him. Don't I'm open that bell. It's Brody. Don't open that out. bell. Uh, is there anything there I can do? No, I'll get him. We need to know what's going on up top. You'll need to go through engineering. The way up is blocked from here. Where's engineering for here? I've never been doing this end before. The only way you'll get there is to go under the rig. Should be a clearer path down there. All right. I'll head down now. Don't open that. Don't open it, please, dude. If you if you keep that closed, it's not gonna be nice for him. But we're all gonna be okay. If you open it, things are not gonna be okay. Okay, I just know. I just know these things. Oh, oh. Christ on a bike. Welcome to the sea. Right, where are we? We are here. And I need to get to engineering. <laughs> mm. You want me to go this way? Uh, okay then. Uh, really? Okay. We can do this. We can do this. Uh, mayhaps. Uh, I've lost track of where we need to be. I've completely lost track of where we need to be. Fuck. I beg your pardon. What the fuck? Oh, fuck. I can hear it. Yeah. What are you doing? Then you get close to that. Come back in sight. What? Cars! Get over here before it falls apart. Find me in sight. That don't look good. And why is my head doing the head things? Come on. Oh, come on. I've got my screwdriver. Oh, why do we need to go? Oh. Come on, Kaz. Come on, Kaz. Come on, Kaz. Come on, Kaz. We're here. We're here. We're safe. We're okay, buddy. We're okay. We're okay. What was that? Right, uh, I'm gonna turn it. Right? Is that right? Yes. Uh, uh the soundtrack's not doing me any favors. This is really, I just, I don't feel like I'm having a moment to just gather my thoughts and think. Oh my God, what is happening? Oh no, 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 no. Shite. Fucking see again. It's a miracle Kaz is still alive. Like, I don't think people maybe realize how bad it is falling in the sea, especially the North Sea. The North Sea is horrid. Oh my god. I'm glad I remembered it was right click and not left click, or that would have been very embarrassing. Come on, Kaz. Christ! 
course. We're okay. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, fucking hell. Oh. Just get across. <laughs> that is not as easy as you think it would be either. What is that stuff? It's translucent almost. Weird. Oh, thank God. Get me in the dry. I feel tense. I, I feel like genuinely kind of like I've just been... I can't relax. Well, this looks ominous as hell, and that hook's bouncing. Yay! I'm gonna call it there, guys, for this first episode, but I'm gonna get a second one up by the end of the week, because I am freaking loving this. I, I don't have much more to say, and that sounds really weird, like, I, I, I feel like I'm so immersed in this world. I feel so invested in Kaz. That was the most stressful, like, 10 minutes of a game I've played in a very long time. I think the most stressful part of a game I've ever played in recent memory was probably Amnesia The Dark Descent. Just to put that into perspective. And I've played a few horror games since then. And we haven't even got to the scary bit yet. What was going on with the guy in the, the diving bell? That was my big thing. What's happened to him? Has he seen something? Has he just lost his mind? Has he completely scattered his marbles into the abyss and will never be the same again? What is that? I think we're about to find out. And I'm not all too happy about that. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. This has been hell for me, but I'm enjoying it regardless. As always, I have been Sturks. You guys have been incredible. I'll catch you all around for the next part of this creepy adventure. <laughs>